Yeah, what's going on everybody? It's our pocket and Carter here. The Superman of YouTube. You already know I had to do the Battlefield beta just like everybody else. Um, I'm a very big fan of first person shooter games. I did have Battlefield 2. The only thing that I did not like about Battlefield 2 was that the players were very small. So it wasn't a very easy target to get. Now some people might think that that is better strategy or... A better part of the game and I say it is and you know to sometimes you want to play arcade games that's why I became a Call of Duty head now in this video it's basically everybody knows it's a beta it's not the final product so you know it's a little scratchy it's a lot of glitches and you know I, I kind of had fun with this you know it was kind of cool you know doing different things trying to get the objective I was playing like Call of Duty for about the first how should I say five minutes and the last three minutes of the game now since I'm a Call of Duty head it's like you don't play certain objectives you know I play a lot of headquarters on Call of Duty but a lot of people use headquarters as a kill a kill horn session like real talk a lot of people will just go to headquarters and camp out and just sit there and just spawn trap a team even though it even though it's not a relative spawn you already know where everybody is going they're gonna go to the headquarters. They're gonna try to plant the bomb. They're gonna try to, you know, get, it's just too much in Call of Duty. So you know, I'm, I'm gonna try this battlefield out, see how it is, and see if I actually like it. Now I'm using the AK, and I don't have a red dot. All I got is iron sights. Now, like I said before, the people are very small. Now, as I seen that flashlight right there, I knew it, I knew I seen somebody, but I couldn't I couldn't really see them because they're so small. So you know, they picked me off something easy now with these dudes these dudes are at higher levels they have red dot sights some have um better guns faster guns you know i'm still i'm on like level one or level two probably i don't even have anything i don't even think i had the upgradable parts for the red dot sight yet <laughs> that's how bad it got for me now one thing that they did at the battlefield which is uh prone as I killed that guy right there while he was on prone, but his partner was chilling between the, uh, the, the, whatever you call those things, the metal detectors, or I don't know what they were, but he was hiding behind, I mean, between those, so he picked me off with ease. Now, one thing I used to love about Battlefield, you never had to spawn directly at your, uh, base. You could always spawn on your partner, you could always, you know, fall back and, you know, just start from scratch and just, you know, Get yourself together get all your moves right now as i keep getting picked off here i know it's looking like i'm, I'm trash at the game which i was you know i wasn't really that good of a battlefield player in battlefield 2. i was i was more of one of those guys that would hop in the tank had a repair kit you know being an engineer whatever it was and just repairing the tank at all times you know for me it wasn't always about kills when i played battlefield it was always about the objective so if dudes needed the tank to get the A, and they really, really needed me to do that, I would really follow the tank from our deployment all the way to the A base and just sit up there and just keep repairing, man. I didn't have a problem with that, you know. It wasn't, it wasn't nothing big. But here, these are. This is one map that we playing on, and I just keep getting picked off. I don't, I don't know, man. Listen, I don't see nobody. Listen, if y'all see these dudes, y'all tell me, cause I don't see anybody. But as I was playing this map, we started in the bottom of the train station, and of course, you know, it told us to fall back. So I'm guessing we lost both both objectives. So you know, we had to move up the stairs, get out into the streets, and it's kind of cool, you know, trying to do different things with your teammates and, and and try to hold down the objective from people that's just constantly coming and coming and coming. You know what I'm saying? It's like it's like real warfare. Like all right, as I pick that dude off with a headshot. You know, that prone is going to be a big thing. You know, if he didn't have the flashlight attachment on, I wouldn't have seen him. He would have picked me off. I wouldn't have seen him. That's 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 just being realistic. But, you know, when when Battlefield really comes out, they say that these graphics right here are like, um, what did Wazadown say to me? He said that like they're light years away from what the game is really supposed to look like. Now, if that's true, this, I don't know, because this, this, this beta, even though the graphics aren't 100% all that, they're still, they're still okay, you know, um, I still I still like the way the gun looks, um, I like the way they do show their legs when you jump over stuff, it is kind of funny, but, you know, 
why why not throw a little bit of graphics in there that Call of Duty doesn't do? All right, as I'm sitting here uh, camping out, I get picked off again. Um, I guess dude finally saw me and said, you know what, I'm tired of this. <laughs> but look look at the way these dudes got um, reptiles and red dot sights and scopes and all of that on their guns. I'm still working with the iron sight. I think I need to fix that in my next match. Now here we're on the street. I um, spawned on top of one of my partners. Looks like we're in something like an ice cream shop. Um, I'm, I am holding up the window a little bit. I'm, I'm hogging all the space, but I don't care. I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna try to run over here. You know, see what I can do. See if I can help my team in any way. Got him. All right, I got picked off again. It's cool. It's, it's, it's totally fine. <laughs> Alright, now see as this dude, he's just laying there prone like I was earlier. You know, that's how you got to play Battlefield. You can't play Battlefield like Call of Duty. You can't just run around and hit fire people all day. Look, as I tried to hit fire this guy right here, he got me out of there. I, I should have tried to throw a knife at him or something. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. If, this, if that was Call of Duty, I would have owned him. Real talk. Also, um, the spawn delay for Battlefield. I kind of like the spawn delay because it's not like a real kill cam. You don't see what the dude did when he killed you. You really can't see where the guy is because it's so close quarters. Like, I'll, I'll show you here. Um, I'm trying to hide from this dude, but of course, you know, his friends see me, so he picks me off. But check out the way this kill, this kill feed looks. All right, look how close it is. You cannot tell where that guy is. In Call of Duty, if you've seen a person in any set, setting and area, you would know where he is. You would know where his partners are. You would see their entire spawn. I like the I like the way Battlefield does that. Now, now another thing I like when you spawn on top of your friends, you spawn in a position that they're in. So if a dude is prone and you spawn on him, you spawn prone, just in case you know he's he's receiving fire from from the enemy base or whatever. It's pretty cool. Now, I'm dying a lot, so, you know, I'm, I'm going to see if I can switch up my classes real fast. I, I really don't know what kind of guns I have, but, you know, I'm going to try this this gun right here, you know, the 74U. See what I can do with it, you know, see if I can put in a little bit of work. All right, let's get up these steps. Let's get this popping. I'm ready to, I'm ready to put some work in now, man. I'm tired of dying all the time. Real talk. All right, you know, I, I just had to go prone right there, you know. I didn't know if anybody was going to come around that corner like they did on last time. Alright, I don't see any of my team right now, so I'm kind of skeptical about going over there. So, you know, I'm going to turn around and see if anybody's coming from this side. Alright, I don't see anybody. Alright, that was a Call of Duty tactic right there, you know. You, you sit there, you know, you wait for a couple spawns. So it doesn't know why it come, you know, you know, it's safe to move on to the next one. Alright, you know, I saw somebody, but, you know, of course, I don't have any red dots, so... You know, I gotta hide out. <laughs> All right, let's run in this building. You know, this is where the train station was, I believe. You know, I'm not too familiar with the map. You know, this is like my second time around, so you know, I really didn't get all the controls right. Now, that little red box to the left. I'm only reason I'm running to it is because that's their base. You know, their base of deployment. So I'm gonna see if I can catch any stragglers just sitting around doing nothing. You know, get a couple easy kills. You know. You know, you have to learn a couple things from Call of Duty, you know. <laughs> Alright, I don't see anybody, so I'm moving on to the next one. Gotta get out of here. You know, I don't want... And plus, another thing, I don't want them to spawn behind me, so, you know, I'm gonna cut it in this corner. Just to make sure there's doesn't nobody, you know, sneak up behind me. Alright, oh, I like the way this bus is sitting here. You know, I might be able to use this as something. Alright, that looks like that's my teammate in there, so... Oh, what's that? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, easy pickings. Oh, easy pickings. Hold on. Ah, uh, come on now. Uh-oh, easy pickings. Okay. Alright, I like the way this looks. Alright. Let's see if somebody else comes out that door. You know? Is this like a spawn trapping moment right now? This is this can't be spawn trapping, can it? Oh, oh, there's another one. Hey, what's up, man? It's 
Sorry I had to kill you. <laughs> Alright. Uh oh oh is that a is that a red dot? Oh snap! I think I got a red dot, y'all. <laughs> Alright, I'm 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 being a noob right now by going in the building to see if anybody else is coming. It's probably because I'm over anxious right now, you know. I think I might have the same amount of kills as death, so try I'm trying not to go negative. I'm trying not to go negative. But you know, teach is on. Alright, now the objective has been armed. So you know I'm trying to trying to see if I can go over there and run around real fast. Let's see if I can help out my team in any way. Alright, oh. Who's that? Who was that? Who killed me? You know what? Forget about it. It's all good. Up, oh, he's prone again. Oh, level 28. Good. Sweet Lord. Yo, this dude must play this game all the time. Up. Oh. oh. My team lost. Hmm. I guess this is the end of the video. It's nothing that I could do. Oh, I went 10 and 11. That last kill made me negative. Darn. But, you know, maybe next time, you know, I'll play the game, I'll go positive. And if I do, I'll post it. You know, I'm not a negative and positive type of player. If I go negative, I'm posting.